the icevi the nippon foundation mathematics package for teachers video series abacus as a mathematical tool title of the video division involving five digit dividend and three digit divisor example 78000 142 divided by 236 and let us take up part 1 now the procedure in solving this problem is presented in two videos as we are dealing with a five digit dividend for the first time and there may be a need to correct the assumed quotient at every stage of the division by looking at the remainder Uh, we had also mentioned that the digits of the dividend are automatically cleared in every stage of division that will allow us to set the quotient at one stage if we do not find a place for setting the second or third digit of the quotient uh, we can realize that we have done some errors in the calculation that should be corrected without resetting the problem let us demonstrate these principles in the next two videos let us set the dividend 78142 in the right extreme of the abacus and the divisor 236 in the extreme left of the abacus as 2 is smaller than 7 the highest uh, digit of the dividend the quotient should be set by skipping a column to the left of the dividend there are three twos in 7 and therefore we can reduce 1 and take 2 uh, as the assumed quotient please note 7 divided by 2 is 3.5 which can be considered equal to 4 for the purpose of selecting a quotient and we can still take 3 as the assumed quotient but as mentioned earlier it is always better to be on the safer side by taking a lower number as the assumed quotient therefore let us proceed with 2 as the assumed quotient let us multiply 2 with 236 and subtract the result from the dividend 2 is multiplied with 2 which is 04 and 0 is subtracted from the 100000s column and 4 subtracted from the 10000s column that is 5 cleared in the upper abacus and 1 added in the lower abacus let us multiply 2 with 3 that is 06 that means 0 is subtracted from the 10000s column and 6 subtracted in the 1000s column let us multiply 2 with 6 that is 12 and for this uh, one should be subtracted in the thousands column and two in the hundreds column as we cannot subtract two from the hundreds column let us subtract one in the thousands column and add eight uh, in the hundreds column we have committed an error here but even if we do not notice the calculation itself will reveal that assume that we are correct and let us proceed to the next stage of setting the assumed quotient in the remaining dividend 3 is the highest digit and 2 is the highest digit of the divisor by quotient setting rule we have to skip a column and set the quotient but there is no column left for setting the additional quotient and therefore we can notice that we have done some error what is the error our assumed quotient is smaller than the real quotient 
as the first three digits of the dividend. In this case, 309 or larger than the divisor 236, that means simply add 1 to the assumed quotient and subtract 236 from 309 that is 2 is subtracted from 3 and for subtracting 3 from the thousands column we subtract 1 in the 10,000s column and add 7 in the 1000s column. Let us subtract 6 in the 100s column. The remaining part of the dividend is 7342. Before proceeding further, let us repeat the procedure followed till now to get a clear understanding of resetting the assumed quotient in the middle of the problem itself and then solve the remaining problem in the next video.